Football League Live with Nationwide. Football matters. Evening all, welcome to the Britannia Stadium here in Stoke for a vital second division clash between Stoke and Brighton. Stoke simply can't afford to lose any more ground as they bid to gain an automatic promotion place, but Brighton may well have other ideas. Deep in the potteries lies a sleeping giant desperate to be woken. Stoke have a stadium fit for first division football. Will the Britannia be hosting it next year? Promotion has to be the goal. Stoke's recent slide was halted by the four-goal mauling of Berry on Tuesday night. Does this mark the start of the Potters' resurgence? Peter Taylor's high-flying Brighton stand in their way, but their hotshot striker Bobby Zamora is suspended. Can they survive without him? Important night in the second division promotion race, fourth against second. So arguably more important that uh, Stoke win tonight. With me in the studio this evening, Tony Dorigo and uh, John Hendry. You're very welcome, gentlemen. OK, John, let's uh, continue with our video scouting reports. You're looking after Brighton this evening. And the big question is how they cope with, or in this case, without, Bobby Zamora. Well, the country's top goal scorer last year, so obviously he's going to be missed. I watched him at uh, Oldham a couple of weeks ago. And uh, obviously Bobby was on the bench on that day. This is him in the away kit in the red here. And I've just uh, circled Bobby on the back post there. And he's just found space for himself in the box. And that was his first touch. Hits the crossbar. Here we go here. This is his creative ability. Just gets the ball here. As it comes into him, he, he's aware. Flicks it around the corner and he's on his way. And he breaks forward. He's very, very positive indeed. Great composure and plays a great little ball. Inch perfect pass ball to Hart. And really Hart should have done better there. So that just shows you how well they do with him and the team. Terrific finisher and great uh, creative ability as well. OK, uh, quick uh, prediction from you guys before we go. Oh, sorry. Well, this is <laughs> We're still well, on this the is without, This is without Bobby. I mean, this was earlier on. This is Webb. He's come in from the wide. Where he should be is central, Danny Webb. He was playing the lone role in there. He should be, if he's back to, back to the goal, and be able to hold the ball up and be a target man for his players. As a result, they can't really get any momentum going because they haven't got a target there. And here we go, another time when Bobby wasn't playing. They just break out from the, the, the right-hand side here, and it's Brooker on the ball, and I'll just freeze it there. He wants the defender to be going back the way. He can play the pass in to Danny Webb, and he's got one and one. But oh no, it takes the wrong choice, and eventually ends up losing the ball. So they are a better team with Bobby Zamora on the side, but and they've struggled the last couple of games with him. Only scored the one going to two games, but who wouldn't be with Bobby Zamora? Sorry for jumping the gun there, John. <laughs> I know they are lovingly crafted. But, uh... That took me three weeks to do as well. <laughs>